Hello, it's Fresh Hair. How are you doing today? Part of my nose, part of my nose, I just, uh, oh, I just had a little sad moment there because I, I, I got to get to know somebody in the music industry. You know, I have a kind heart. And uh, it, it, it sometimes comes across a little blunt sometimes. But when something touches my heart and I get discernment from God above that this is a perfect opportunity not to not to coattail off somebody else's demise, but to basically shed light on this man's life. You know, when you got everything in front of you, and nobody is liking you. You like lose your friends. Nobody's picking up what you're cooking. You know what I'm saying? Like you have a different discernment. You have a different way of how you walk. You have a different way of how you speak. You have a different way of just how you conduct yourself. You walk into rooms and you automatically change the energy of the room. And you don't even have to say anything. You could have an argument with somebody. Somebody could say something messed up around you. you just your look is enough. And it's not that you purposely try to have this persona. It's just you're blessed with knowing if you're walking in the light every day, 24-7, even when you're sleeping, you're, you're, you're reminded of your opportunity to be your best self through the eyes of the Lord Jesus and as you, as you go through life you'll see you'll have some hiccups here and there but I promise you this things do get easier once you start seeing the miracles happening around the world okay you can see the efforts people put in and I am a social media specialist. I have been in social media long enough. We're talking a short period. I mean, if you blink, social media passed you by already. 2018 was the boom of the 15 second clips. Flipgram was, you know, blah, blah, blah. So the influx of people getting incited into their phones. Now, before 2018, I guarantee if you watch people's videos or whatever, you're going to see that there was no video, you know, people didn't have their phones out much before that, you know what I'm saying, there wasn't the entertainment factor at your fingertips, so the distraction, but also the glorious distraction, <laughs> happens right in these last five years, so basically from April 2018 till now, right? I mean, I can't discuss certain things because they'll get my channel cut. Uh, but, three through three on the clock, you gotta think, wow, 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 a lot of, a lot of things have happened in five years on the 15 second clips. I mean, let's, let's go back to the music industry. Now, the music industry now seen a new opportunity to put music out, right? We still have music on the top 10 from 2018. We have still music from 2018 on the top 50 on, on these platforms, okay? I'm, I'm, I'm serious. I, I can't iterate the malfunction that's happened, all right? All right, so today, I literally got uh, a check mark for uh, copyright. It seems to be happening a lot. Um, okay, I don't deal with people from another, this, this country that uh, they basically said I copyrighted. Uh, it's 444 on the platform too. Basically, I got copyrighted because they said I made money off my TikTok. 
not just posted that, you know, that, that the only way it would say I made money of that is if it went viral immediately, right? I've had videos where it was 12 minutes, it had, 50, you know, I had, what, 1,400 likes, 14,000 views in 12 minutes, and then the, the track gets uh, muted because of my music, because they say it's not me. My voice is me. My creativity is me. Uh, I speak with clarity with God above. You know what I'm saying? My creativity and my spontaneous uh, opportunities to share the word and how I got to where I am is my creativity. There's nobody that can take that away. You know what I'm saying? Not even Lucifer himself. The best thing you can do is think about this. 555 five, five, change, right? Change is happening with all of us. We all know that there is a fork in the road where you make a decision. Now, I wanted to like iron this out a little bit, make it a little fun a little bit. Now, I want people to understand we're not trying to push you off a cliff. We're trying to make an avenue so we can have equal opportunity when it comes to vibrations and healing, okay? You know what I'm saying? See, for the longest time in almost five years, we've had only one sound, okay? It's our time to get our time back. You know what I'm saying? Our time means we need, the, the communities have been speaking for, okay? If you haven't seen the, the, the spiritual healing music starting to flourish, <clears throat> then you must be under a rock. If, if you go back to some of my videos and you listen to my prophetic messages with psychic abilities, not really psychic, I basically iron out, a, you know, what's to come and I talk about with clarity on a spiritual, you know, divine timing. Now, who has the discernment to take control when God isn't taking control, right? Who's that? Nobody. There is no time I can turn that click, click, turn off God and think my ego is going to take me to the promised land. Now, when we get gifted with the opportunity on certain stages, when we get to the prime time, you know what I'm saying, the money's flowing, things are moving. Now, remember, people stop liking you. They stop liking you because they feel like they can't relate. Oh, he's got those chains on, the bling. He's got, you know, it's the image thing, right? It's the automatic image that people are stuck on. Like, damn, I can't do that, I can't do that. It's an automatic thing we're chasing. When it shouldn't be material things we're chasing, we should be chasing wisdom. We should be chasing the light. The light is good. 2024 is going to be a fantastic year for a lot of people. Now, does it involve me? Does it involve a lot of other people? Yes, if you, if you haven't heard the community spoke and also the artists are already primed and ready to go. You got true chosen ones that have been awakened with the gift of understanding that with true intuition and guidance and practice, you can have a better relationship with God because that war that we all have been talking about is within ourselves. So if we all do our own part and just allow a little bit of that light into your life, just to, I know for some it's the first time ever hearing about the Lord. I get that. And I can't take that what you've been to either. I go, I know that. But God can, He can help take us where some of those silos. Some of the things you've been holding on to. I'm not here to hash that out today. I'm here to give you praise and understanding that today is now. This morning, I was gifted with the opportunity to have a couple of I, I listened to some of my, my friends. I call them friends now. I call them friends because we have that spiritual connection that no matter what, I'm still there for them in spirit. I don't have to hit the like, but I'm there. 
I try my best to get my kids to stand up what I do every day Cause a lot of people wonder if you know what I do every day Plus, what do you do every day? Well, we always have to think about our daily routines, okay? Now, when the weather changes, our daily routines might change. The sun gets a little darker during certain times of the year. The sun gets a little brighter during certain times of the year. Remember to change your clocks back on, on Sunday. Now, an easy way to remember how to change your clocks, I thought they were going to stop it, but fall is fall behind, so that means the clock goes back an hour. You gain an hour. Spring is spring ahead, so then the hour will go ahead. Does that make sense? It's kind of the simplest way to remember. So at 2 in the morning, basically you're supposed to bring your clock back to 1 a.m. One time. Not keep doing that, but it would be true. Yeah, it'd be 1 a.m. every hour. Something to tell you. But no. Hear me out though. Most clocks uh, just change themselves. But I want your internal clock to start recognizing your daily energy. You know? Figure out your daily energy. Figure out how strong you can be through certain... It's 11, 11 on the clock. Um, figure out where your energy source is going to. What's your daily meditation? What, what, what things do you feed your eyes and ears? You know, what kind of vibrations from sun up to sundown? And see if you can slide in there all that, you know, off time or where you feel like kind of like your thoughts are just taking you, put on some meditation. There's plenty of meditation lo-fi music out there for you. Matter of fact, they've been doing fresh air lo-fis for the longest time. Not, not because of me, but I'm saying because of the lo-fi information, you know, the, the lo-fi vibrations. There's so many different vibrations that are healing. If you have surround sound, I suggest trying it. Also, if you have a nice uh, sound system in your car, try that. But don't have it turned on while you're in the garage, obviously. All right, so what you want to do is find those people. You don't have to narrow your your, your 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 network down. Find out where you put your time. Where do you put your time? How much effort do you put into certain people that are kind of towing their line? You know what I'm saying? If they're towing their spiritual journey, don't give, don't give up on them. Also, if you're divinely there for a reason, for a few people, it's for a purpose. And when I said that from the beginning, I meant it. I'm not somebody... To, I have a lot of experience. A lot of it's far-fetched where you could probably make a book and a movie out of it. It's just the experience you have is your own, and only you can live it. The triumphs of feeling where you met your goals of getting 1.5 million followers or 1.8 million followers in a short amount of time, like four months, but that was back at the beginning. That was when there was less people around. That means the active users was at a higher rate than a person that took two, three years to get through the You get what I'm saying? You're not going to have as many active. The goal now is not about the followers. It's about making sure you're still connecting to the people you're supposed to and engaging in those positive uh, opportunities to grow. Positive opportunities to be your best self. Remember, focus in the moment. Unplug the past, unplug the future. Take the moment to grow, to heal, to see things differently, to have that opportunity to have clarity in how you speak, how you see things, and how you learn, and how you listen to people. Don't get frustrated if something's 20 minutes long to listen to. Listen to it. Just try to indulge yourself into people's teaching. You'll start learning things differently. God bless all of you. No weapons formed against you should prosper. And I hope that this channel energy from the, yeah, yeah, Lionsgate 808, fresh air, sign up.